Hi, my name is Peter Lindemann and I'm with Tesla Chargers and today we're going to be talking about the Energenics 2A12. This is the little giant of a, a charger that's primarily uh, for 12 volt batteries. It's a 2 amp charger and so it's really in the, you, most people think of it in the class of just a trickle charger but this has uh, a number of other features in it that make it way better than that. First of all, it's a, a, a typical uh, energetics charger, which means that it can take the battery absolutely to the top of its chemistry. So uh, we talk about it as a topping charger, not just a trickle charger. And um, and secondly, this is this is a pulse um, system, so it can give uh, pretty significant surges of current uh, during the charge process. So um, even though um, it looks like a small charger. Uh, you can put this on a fairly large battery and it will uh, charge it uh, if given enough time. So what I want to do today is I want to demonstrate how the charger works. Okay. Now because this, this charger is um, a, a capacitor discharge uh, circuitry, um, uh, we don't ever want to short circuit the uh, the connections, okay, because that will just discharge the capacitor uh, in a very high current situation and um, that may damage the charger. So never short circuit the, uh, the, the, the leads, okay. The second thing is, is that because that's true also, we want to connect the charger to the, the, the battery that's going to be charged even before we uh, plug it into its universal supply. Okay, so what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to connect so you can see that the, the charge light is on simply because I'm connected to the uh, battery. Okay, it's right now it's not charging because we don't have any power connected to it. So I'm going to uh, set this up so we can watch what happens. Uh, as, as the charge process starts, okay? So we can see that this battery that we're going to demonstrate here is already at 12.71, which uh, is essentially, a, it's fully charged already. And I'm, I'm, I'm using a battery like this so I can show you what happens um, at the top end of the charge. And in other words, what will happen when uh, the charge is finishing. Okay, so here we go. We have the charger connected to the battery. We have the battery connected to the voltmeter. And now what I can do is I can um, plug in the, the power supply to the charger. And, and now we can start seeing, um, uh, first of all, we see the green light on, on the power supply, not showing. Okay. And now the thing is, you can see the pulses starting to move into the battery. So we see um, uh, a fair amount of, of uh, numbers jumping around, but we can see that this top number is starting to rise uh, pretty quickly uh, as the pulses uh, come into the battery. So we've gone from 12.71 and we're already almost at 14. Um, so uh, this is, we're going to be able to demonstrate um, what the topping event looks like and what happens uh, to the charger as it approaches the top. So we're at about 14.5. Okay, and now we're at 14.6 and now we can see what's happening is the green light is starting to flash, okay, along with the red. And what that means is, is that the, the voltage is above about, uh, you saw on the, on the meter was about 14.6. And now we're above 15 here, and now you can see that these are almost um, flashing equally. Okay, and as we continue to push the voltage a um, little higher, we'll eventually. Um, so you can see when we're in this uh, condition, the red and green lights flashing almost evenly, we can see that. The, the voltage in the battery is at about 15 volts, and, um, and it can push it can push batteries this size. It can push batteries 
four or five times this size to these voltages without any problem. It just takes a little longer because again, it is just a two amp charger. So um, uh, by the time you get up to 15 volts, um, you're, you're probably a volt higher than, than almost any other commercial charger would push the battery. And um, uh, so it's got a lot of power in it right now, but, it's, but the chemistry isn't quite finished, which is, um, which is why it's still working on it. But um, if you get it to this point, um, uh, it's, it's perfectly fine to uh, take the charger off and use it. But if it goes all the way to um, a solid green, then basically the uh, battery is pretty much uh, finished. But one of the things I want to show you, um, if my assistant can get me a screwdriver, I want to open this up and I want to show you that um, there really isn't uh, very much uh, off-gassing uh, happening, even at these upper voltages. One of the reasons why most chargers uh, don't ever want to push a battery this high is that uh, there's a lot of off-gassing, uh, a lot of hydrogen production. And, um, and what, what we might be able to see in here is essentially almost no bubbles at all. And that is exactly the point. Um, that this charger is capable of bringing this battery to the top of its chemistry without producing almost any hydrogen and oxygen gases at all. And it also and so that is the difference between this charger and almost every other charger uh, uh, available. And um, it also remains at room temperature. And so what that tells me is, is that all the energy that I'm taking out of the wall that I'm paying for is getting into the chemistry. None of it's being lost in heat production. None of it's being lost in hydrogen production. So this uh, is a good demonstration of what we call a topping charger. And this is exactly the kind of equipment that you need uh, if you want to uh, make your battery last for a very, very long time. Um, and because that is a requirement for longevity, it's also a requirement for uh, taking older batteries and bringing them back to what we call like new condition and that's a process we call battery rejuvenation. And we uh, have put together a number of, of uh, information products which can teach you from, from start to finish exactly what it takes to take old batteries and rejuvenate them using this type of equipment. And uh, those are available. Uh, there are links on uh, the Tesla Chargers website uh, under the banner that says um, battery secrets and if you click on that they talk about there's um, two products that are talked about one of them is called battery secrets talks about the chemistry of the battery how it works and the other one is called battery rejuvenation and it talks about how to undo um, the, uh, the the dense uh, crystalline sulfates that build up in the plates after um, long misuse so um, um, we're, we're pretty much floating right here in the 15.1 uh, uh, range. And um, uh, so this has been a, a good demonstration of the 2A12. It's a 2 amp um, charger specifically for 12 volt batteries, primarily flooded lead, cell, uh, lead acid batteries, although it can be used on small gel cells and, and otherwise, but it's always best to use these on flooded cells um, because um, they can uh, handle uh, a the little bit of off-gassing at the top of the charge. So um, that's um, this charger. Um, when you buy it, it comes with its own uh, owner's manual and it comes with the charger and it comes with the power supply. And this is a universal power supply uh, that can be used on uh, power, uh, plug-in power from uh, any country in the world. Uh, you may have to get your own um, uh, type of plug if you're in uh, countries other than uh, in North America. Uh, but um, other than that, it's, it's ready to go right out of the box and start uh, rejuvenating your batteries. So um, 
Uh, again, uh, I'm Peter Lindemann, and this is Tesla Chargers. <laughs>